What is cracking, collectors? Collector Tyrant here again today, bringing you another opening of some awesome Pokemon products. Before I start this, I want to let everyone know that I've been a bit slack on my upload times and schedules and stuff like that. In the last two weeks, I've been part of a competition with my uh, hobby store. I have to build this uh, model and paint it, and I'm in a competition, so I've been working really hard on that. That's why there's been no Sunday sessions. And yeah guys, it's been really hard to get things done. I've been trying to do this competition. I came in late for the competition and I've been working pretty hard on it. So, so if you guys are watching this video now, I want to apologize for all the mishaps lately. And everything's going to go back to normal as the uh, competition ends this week. Hopefully I should have everything done by then. And I'll also show you guys what I built and painted also in the next Sunday session. Yeah guys, everything will go back to normal. As I said, I've been busy with that. Also, I've been noticing that there's this huge pack battle thing going on with Leonhard and unlisted leaf that everyone's getting amongst. So yeah guys, um, I really I really would like to be a part of that myself and do one of those videos as well. Hopefully I can do that by next week. Also guys, I've got pack battles coming back as well. So pack battles will be returning. I'm currently looking for an opponent at the moment for some burning shadows. So yeah guys, I think I might have one lined up already. So pack battles will return. So I can't wait to have a pack battle with all you guys out there. It's coming back on the channel. So that's really epic. I really can't wait to do that again. And yeah guys, everything's going sort of back to normal. I really can't wait to do that. And I'm going to be adding more things on the channel as well. But anyway, I've been talking too much already, I think. Um, um, what i got here today, we've got some product. And that is the Venusaur Tin. The Team Up Venusaur Tin. And this awesome little Kanto uh, Bulbasaur Tin. So if you guys want to stick around and see what cars I pull out of these awesome tins right here. And sit down and relax. And let's get into this video, eh? guys so we're gonna leave the Venusaur tin to last and look at that art that's really epic I love this art it's so nice it really is I love Venusaur's design a lot of people think it's quite a clunky design I guess but I love Venusaur I really do and this card here I can't wait to get this in my hands and actually hold it and show you guys but we're gonna get this that last we're gonna start with a little tin here of Bulbasaur first because I think it's you know it's simple it's not much going on here we can get into it nobody's things up quite fast so we're gonna get into this guy here and have a look at what cards we get so give me a second to get this open for you all right, guys, so we've got a tin, and that is very shiny. Look how shiny that is, that's epic. So we're gonna have a look at what's inside this little tin. Let's pop that open. All right, guys, so we've got a, looks like a Genoset coin. I was expecting something a little bit different, possibly a Bulbasaur, but that's all right, that's quite nice. I really like that. Coins are really cool now, because you can actually get them graded as well, coins, so I've got quite a few in my collection already. But we have this awesome Bulbasaur art here. Also, we've got some stats here for Bulbasaur, the height and weight and etc. Like a little dex injury. As you can see there, I've got the art there of Bulbasaur. So there's quite a few to collect. So I might have to get some more down the line. But that's really nice. I really love that. All right, so what uh, packs have we got here? We've got a Burning Shadows pack. That's really nice. And we've got a Fates Collide. So we've got no new stuff. But that's all right. I'm guessing they're trying to sell off the old packs. But Burning Shadows is becoming super hard to find lately, guys. So it's really good to open up some Burning Shadows. We're going to open this guy up right now and see what we get. Actually, no, no. We'll do Fates Collide first because I have no idea. I might be getting some nice in that... um. Burning Shadows pack. All right, here's a code card for you. All right, one, two, three, four, I think it is for this. I usually do five, but I do believe the old sets are four for me. So we're gonna go into this. We've got a Reverse Hollow Wormadam, and that is right. So I've got the card trick I do correct. So that's awesome. So hopefully we get something nice in this uh, pack. So Snivy, we have a Jigglypuff for some friends, Snivy and some others. We have a Fennekin with a Chikorita having a race. We have a Snabble. I love saying that, Schnabel. We have a uh, de-evolution spray. I have to center that more for you guys. Focus on what I'm doing. We have an Omanite. Looks like he's having a bit of a gurgle, sucking in some uh, bubbles there. We have a last, last special, last is special. Julie really started there, and we have just a bar barnacle. Nothing spectacular. That's all right. We have a burning shadows, guys. Notorious. Rainbow rare Charizard. Will I get it today? I highly doubt it. <laughs> like as I said, guys. This. These packs are super hard to find in my stores. Also, they're super hard to open by the look of it. <laughs> Alright, so we've got this open, that's good. And we got Riolu off the bat there. So, let's see what we get for the code card. I don't want to give it away too early for you. And hopefully no one snipes that. There you go, guys. There's your code card. One, two, three, four, five to the back. Let's see what we get. I've opened up so much Burning Shadows in my life. I have no idea how many packs I've opened up of Burning Shadows, but it's been a lot. We have a Dusk, uh, Dusk Bell there, doing a dab. We have a Tynemo in the Knitted Art. We have Cutiefly flying around there for you. We have Riolo running down the beach. 
We have a Simi Sage in the jungle. We have a Kick and Karelia doing a little dance there. We have Heat More, really um, underrated Pokemon that one. We have a Leaf Energy and we have just Shinotic. Yeah, nothing spectacular in that tin, guys. Nothing spectacular. All right, guys, so the Kanto tin did not deliver. Can this team up Venusaur tin deliver for us? I really would like to put some good cards out of this. So I'm gonna open this up for you. Just give me one sec. I'm just gonna pop that off. All right, so let's see what we got here. All right, guys, so we've got a GX uh, marker here, guys, for your games. That's a really heavy, heavy GX marker. That's really epic. Really awesome, I like those. They're really cool. We have some packs here. We've got three packs, four packs. Also, we have two team up and a Forbidden Light and Evolutions, guys. I haven't touched some Evolutions in a long time. But we have that beautiful, beautiful car that we get with the promo. And that is our Venusaur and Selby. That is beautiful. That really is. I think it even is textured. It actually is textured, guys. So that's really nice. But anyway, guys, we are here for the opening. And I'm going to open up some Forbidden Light to start us off. Forbidden Light, guys. Nice, easily open pack, too. I really like that. All right, so we've got the ooh, co car for you. Try not to get anyone sniping that for you. We've got a one, two, three, four, five to the back. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get inside this pack. We have a gloomy reverse holographic. We have a rock rough. We have a Fennekin. We have Inke. Noibat. Skidoo. Landers of Labs. Fossil Excavation Map. We have a Ultra Recon Squads. We have a Fire Energy and we have nothing spectacular to finish us off. So that's unfortunate, guys. All right, so nothing great so far, guys, out of three packs, but we're gonna get this Evolutions pack open. And I do believe I have two cards that are missing from this. I think it's only two cards left. And I love this set. I really do love this set. Uh, we're gonna use the Code Card for you, so don't snipe that, guys. And there it is. There's a Code Card. And with these old sets, I believe it's four to the back for my card trick. So hopefully we open up with a reverse holo, and we do a nice reverse holo there. Clefairy, could barely see the name there. We have a Volpix, shout out Casual Collector. We have a Tangler, an epic old school uh, art. I think it's a Mashiro Rita. We have a Machop, we have a Weedle. We have a Onyx, shout out Fur. We have Pokedex, Poliwhirl. Hit full heal, and we have an Arcanine. Nothing spectacular again, guys. I do love Arcanine, it's one of my favorite Pokemon. But so far, we've had duds, man. Like, I'm hoping that this episode is not gonna be too boring. All right, guys, but we do have two tag team, and I'm hoping that we do pull some decent cards out of this, because tag team, as everyone knows, if you've been watching, has been one of my most lucky sets to open up. I always pull some decent cards out of this set. I really do. Really nice cards, and the packs are super tight, so let's try and get it. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Awesome. Okay, so I'm hoping that these two packs deliver. We've had some real bad cards, or bad pulls at least, but I'm not complaining. I love opening up cards for you guys. One, two, three, four, five to the back. I think that's five. I hope I don't screw this up. What do we got here? We got a Reverse Holo, Nanu. We have a Emolga. Flying through the sky there, electric little squirrel. We have a Psyduck, got a little quack for that. We have Zora, peeking around the corner, spying on some friends. We have a Dratini, awesome. We have a Vol Vol Volatibi, I can't even say his name properly, we're going too fast here. We have a Golduck, epic Golduck art. We have a Water Memory. We have an Omanite in an epic art there. We have a Water Energy, and we have a Beedrill, jeez. It doesn't look too good, we have one pack left. Mimikyu and Gengar, we have one pack left. I'm not too hopeful, to be honest. I'm hoping that we can pull some last pack magic, or luck, I like to call it. Because I really don't want to... Just give me a sec to open this pack up, guys. It's taking me forever. All right, let's open this up. we finally got it open. We have Heli Optile off the bat there, and the code card for you guys there. No one's sniping that. All right, so let's do it. We have one, two, three, four, five to the back. Let's see what we get. Hopefully we can take this home because I really don't want to have just the promo card to show you guys. We have a reverse holo Nidoran, ran, and that is a beautiful uh, reverse holo. I love that. We have a Squirtle, epic guard of Squirtle. We have a Pancham, epic. Let's keep going. We have Volpix, shout out Casual Collector once again. We have a Mankey running through the forest there. <laughs> we have a Helioptile, the first card we open up with. We have a Dana, Dana, and we have a Golduck, another Golduck. We have a Water Memory, looks like the same sort of thing we that's going on last time, but we did get a darkness energy, nothing watery there like last time. And we have just a Zeb Striker. Hmm. 
All right, guys, so we didn't get anything that great. We only got one epic card, and that was already foreseen because this is the card that comes with the tin. I feel really bad that I didn't pull anything nice because Team Up has usually been quite nice to me, but unfortunately, you win some, you lose some in this uh, in this game that is Pokemon card collecting. But I can't complain about this card. This is a beautiful piece. It really is. I love it. I'd love to have more of these in my collection. I just love the art on this one. But anyway, guys, that's going to be my Pokemon opening for this week. Um, unfortunately, nothing spectacular in, in this opening, but... It is what it is, and I'm just making videos for you guys, so hopefully you guys do enjoy the content I do bring out when I do get good cards and stuff like that. But anyway, guys, um, I'm really happy. As I said before, we're going to bring back pack battles and all that jazz to the channel. I might even get amongst the, uh, the Unlisted Leaf pack battle that's going around at the moment and make up for my loss today, and hopefully get some good pulls out of those uh, 10 packs. I believe it's 10 packs we have to do. So I really can't wait to do that. I'll be doing that uh, possibly next week. Um, hopefully get a pack battle for next week. Uh, more Funko Pops and all that jazz uh, coming on the channel and more stuff down the line too, guys. I really can't wait to show you that model I've been working on for this competition. So, yeah, guys, really cool. I really hope you uh, enjoyed the, the video as much as it was a bit of a dud. But um, we're going to leave it with you guys for today. Before you collect this out there, keep on collecting, and we'll see you in the next one. All right, collect, sign out.